We're back on STL Live, and I'm joined by Anina Christensen and Max Cassily from Falling Awake, which I should preface this, it's Halloween. This is a big Halloween celebration, but it's an interesting kind of spin that you guys have done to it. So, Max, why don't you start us, start us off? Yeah. Who is Falling Awake? Uh, well, uh, we... Uh we both went to a thing in New York City called uh, Sleep No More, and it was very beautiful. It's called a, it's a full immersion play. Okay. We both commented uh, how cool it would be to do something yeah. Yeah. in the same vein, <laughs> and then we decided to forget about doing that, and now we have Falling Awake. It's pretty fun. <laughs> takes a lot of those themes, so it's really immersive artistic experience uh, with a lot of different performances and surprises and treasures and all kinds of things. So did you, was it, did you all along want to do this at Halloween or does it just happen to fall on the calendar in October? Yeah. Is there any kind of like overlap in that sense? Not so much? Yeah, it kind of just happened. Yeah, it's very organic. Yeah. yeah. It's just sort of like, oh, Halloween's a great time to do this. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, why not now as opposed to, what, are you going to wait yeah, until like next Halloween? Yeah. Right. <laughs> <laughs> or later in the year. Well, walk us through, because we've got some images of some of the bands playing. I mean, and we even have this poster that you brought. And there's a lot of performances. So, I mean, kind of when we show up, it's taking place this Thursday. What are we going to see? Uh, well, at 6.30, we're going to meet up and we're going to have an escape act. And that's going to start off the Falling Awake celebration. As by Dr. Judith Lynch. Yes. She's the only escape artist in the Midwest. Yes. Wow. That's really interesting. And that's he, he's cool. in the same school of, of Houdini. So, mm -hmm. yeah, that's he, uh, me and her are both fans of Houdini. Um, he is. My wife also is. So yeah. we're really excited. Um, and then at, uh, like, I'd really like everybody to get there at 6.30 or 7 o'clock, mm -hmm. you know, kind of yeah, vamp up because uh you know the celebration because we're going to have the bands uh piled on thick i think yes. i think there's five <laughs> bands and then there's just a whole bunch of other performers yeah there's it's we're looking at who's uh anina who, so who's this that we're looking oh at? this is the river kittens okay yeah. river They're kittens great. we've got yeah. River yeah, kittens. Si sirens of si uh, that sing very lovely you know <laughs> <laughs> yeah um, and Ooh. the Bobby Dazzlers, yeah, those photos really mm. good. <laughs> uh, really, there's 15 performers billed on the poster, but there's even more than that. Yeah. With the and more at the bottom because it just kept this adding This is kids on. scientists. Oh, kids scientists yeah, are yeah, great. Yeah. 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 Um, um, yeah, that's still kids. Oh, yeah, another kid scientist. <laughs> oh, they really loved St. Louis local band. Um, mm -hmm. Yeah, so uh, apart from all the stuff on the poster, there'll be bands, there'll be a freak oh, show. Oh, yeah, you forgot 18 and Counting is also going to be yeah, there. 18 yeah, 18 and Counting, yeah, yeah, yeah he's a great band. DJ, yeah. and he's making an art installation to go along with his He's event. actually got a band with him this time, too. Oh, he yeah. does, too. It's going to be just lots of crazy great things. Uh, and, uh, oh, this is not quite right. This no, must be in there. It's an improv group. Uh, so it's a breadth of different performances, right. as you can tell, yeah. And then there'll also be like fortune tellers and uh, a witch with bugs you can eat and roaming, you know, characters and all kinds of different Let's surprises. Let's step back for a second. Yeah. A witch with <laughs> bugs you can eat, you yeah. can actually digest. It's, it's her mom. Don't yeah, it's her mom. <laughs> so happens to own the fountain on Locust. I didn't tell you this. Oh, yeah. So she's, okay. yeah, she's in the, you know, the local scene and loves she performing. Mean she cooks <laughs> bugs very well. Yeah. <laughs> and so people can sample bugs. Listen, there's yeah. like the new cuisine, protein-filled cuisine. Yeah, so. they'll be in the bug room at the same in a museum, very fitting. So when you talk about this like immersive experience, I mean, what's what's when you and you went to this? What sparked the interest was in New York, this yeah. event that you went to. What is, exactly does that mean? Uh, immersive? Well, not immersive, but an immersive experience. Okay, so from an, it's <laughs> just Mac. we're, we're going to smell with. Um, uh, we're going to smell. We're, that that would be one that we could actually mess with. But uh, <laughs> you change the uh, the room, the overall vibe of everything. So that it, you can't tell if you're in a dream or if you're, um, maybe <laughs> if you're, yeah, I don't know, in a movie. You know, I yeah, kind of want to so feel like you fell out of a movie. environment. Yeah. Yeah, all of the aspects of it immerse you in the experience. Yeah, exactly. you definitely are just like in a new world. Thus, falling awake. Well, yeah. it's called falling awake, as we said. You don't know whether it's a reality or a dream. The whole idea is you have to decide for yourself, and you have to go check it out. It's taking place this Thursday, October tw 29th, from seven a clock to midnight at City Museum, which is already just an awesome place to go to. Uh, for more information, look at the information on your screen, or you can email Anina at anina at onfcl.com. But we're going to talk more about this great event that's coming up, so don't go anywhere. We're going to return more with Anina and Max from Falling Awake.